Well, you know, this is pretty low even for a criminal. Tonight, police want to find the person who stole a Boy Scout trailer from a church parking lot. Yeah, the trailer belongs to Troop 215 in Gainesville. Fox News Denise Dillon is live in Gainesville tonight. And Denise, those scouts, they've got to be really disappointed. Yeah, the best the scout leaders have been able to figure out is that trailer was stolen either late Sunday or Monday. It was parked right here. Now, most of the scouts didn't find out about it until last night when they showed up at church for a scout meeting and saw a police officer right here writing a report about a stolen trailer. first thought in my mind is why would someone steal from the church and then I was like why would someone steal from kids. It's a question that police are trying to answer. Assistant Scoutmaster Adam Whitmire says Troop 215's trailer was parked right here just a few yards from the Church of Latter-day Saints on Riverside Drive in Gainesville. The same place it's been parked for years but the space is now empty. A thief snuck off with the trailer and everything inside. There was a ton of supplies for cooking. We had our grill, our stove, tables, camp chairs. We had this picnic table in there. It was about, it was, um, it was brand new. Scout leaders say all the camping gear that the boys used on trips like this adds up to about $3,000. Many of the supplies were bought by the kids using money they raised. We sell the scout cards to, um, to raise money for that kind of stuff. It was my favorite that we were in scout camp. <laughs> Some of these boys have been in scouts for years, earning merit badges as they learn valuable lessons. The stolen trailer is a lesson that doesn't come with a badge or a sense of accomplishment, but one filled with disappointment. It is a life lesson, and the best thing that we can do is set a good example of teaching them how to kind of quickly bounce back. Now that trailer is white and clearly marked Boy Scouts of America, Troop 215, Church of Latter-day Saints. If you see it, the Boy Scouts want it back. Reporting live in Gainesville, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News. Well, let's hope they get it back. Denise, thanks.